Well, crime scene detectives were back out here at the hotel tonight waiting to execute a search warrant. We now know the assault rifle was found on the 28th floor hidden in a public place and with it a 30 round magazine. Local, state and federal law enforcement officers converged on Greektown Hotel, a coordinated response to a possible terror threat. We responded and we mitigated a threat. There was no guests in danger. This is what I call good police work. Detroit Police Chief James Craig says after a fire alarm was set off this morning around 7 a.m., hotel security found an AK-47 in a bag with a Bible and a note that referenced multiple U.S. cities hidden behind an ice machine. Detroit was not listed, but a couple of the cities that were listed were cities where there have been mass shooting incidents. Two men were taken into custody without incident. Police have not released their identities. However, they did say the men are from a suburb of Cleveland, Ohio, and were dropped off at the hotel around 11 p.m. last night. Meantime, as the intense investigation played out this afternoon, this nearby business owner says he was in contact with authorities. Everything was uh, followed by the book and everything was prevented and Again, our goal to keep this district safe was accomplished. The entertainment district is a gaming and nightlife destination, and he depends on a safe atmosphere for his livelihood. Being a popular destination for decades, um, we're always going to be in the news. The worst was avoided today. The chief also told us it's not the first time the suspect stayed at this hotel. He also says they may be linked to narcotics trafficking. They are being held on possession of a dangerous weapon with unlawful intent. That gun was registered. The big question tonight, to who? We'll continue to ask questions outside the Greektown Hotel. I'm Rudy Harper, 7 Action News.